back in this country. We're expecting more gusty winds and dry conditions across parts of the West today, fueling those historic wildfires. This morning, we have a new survival story from Oregon, where one fire trapped a man inside a dam where he works for days. ABC's Andrew Fujii reports. As the Beachy Creek fire raged outside in Detroit, Oregon, dam operator Mike Pomeroy was hunkered down inside. He'd come to check on the dam that provides water to the people of Salem, worried the fire could damage it. As the fire approached, he tried to evacuate, but was driven back by smoke and flames. I have a, uh, a safety ring at, by the door, and I was going to wet that down and make a dash for it and grab the ring and jump in the river if I got chased out of here. He'd lost all communication with the outside world, trapped inside the multi-level facility, which was starting to fill with smoke. He set up a cot and supplies in a hallway, knowing if anyone were to come, they'd find him. It was a continuous process of trying to think of things. I was brainstorming, well, what about this, what about that, and trying to come up with some pro uh, solutions and problems. Outside the dam, the Beachy Creek Fire, one of several fires in the Jackson County area, destroyed nearly 2,400 residential structures. Multiple fires also raging in Washington and California. And overnight, word that 250 U.S. Marines and sailors will now be sent to help fight the Creek Fire burning in Central California. Back in Oregon, with no sense of when he'd be able to escape, Pomeroy's concern turned to his family. I kind of knew that they were very, very worried about me. Nearly two days later, a relief crew finally made it to the dam. And with Pomeroy's help, they got the dam generators back online. Officials with the Army Corps of Engineers credits Pomeroy for protecting the water supply for the city of Salem by preventing more damage. Kenneth. Mona. Incredible story there, Andrea. Thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.